What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. This daily tea, I know it's pre recorded, but I told you guys I would probably start pre recording them more often, and so today is one of them. Um, I have finished. I just want to let everybody know the reason it's late. One is because I was doing the rest of the readings for week four. All signs are up for week four of 2021. And there's plenty of collective readings on there and the daily teas and all that. So everything's caught up as of right now for November um, with three days to spare. <laughs> Just saying. Um, I wish I'd had it done a few days prior to that, but it is what it is. But they're all up now. All signs are up. All zodiac signs are up. So um, they're up for your viewing pleasure. Um, I wanted to say real quick, too, welcome all the new subs I've had in recently. Um, I've had an influx of people come in recently. And thank you guys for all the love and support to the channel. Um, I appreciate it. Tell a friend if they are interested um, in listening to the spirit messages. Um, I would appreciate it. Uh, all, the, all the support to the channel. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. I really do. Um, from the bottom of my heart chakra, I do. Um, every like, subscribe, share, um, word of mouth to my channel. Um, I appreciate it. I do, I do, I do, do. I'm single mom with two kids, so it truly, really helps. Just saying. Okay, so the channel, I did get a channel in. That's what made me do the daily tea. I wasn't even going to do the daily tea because I had finished all the ch um, readings. And if you have notifications all turned on to my channel, you would know that I'd, I posted the rest of the zodiacs today. So I wasn't even going to do the daily tea. But I got a channel in. Um, I'm going to do some traveling today. Not very extensively, but a little bit. But before I go, I'm going to do the daily tea because I got channeled in. So, okay. So the um, channel message I received was um, someone who once was in witness protection program, uh, in the witness protection program, they played huge victim. It's about to backfire on them in a huge way. That's what I heard. So someone who once played a huge victim in the witness protection program. So they were placed under a witness protection program in some shape, form, or fashion. Now, whatever go governmental entity, agency, energy placed them under it, I don't know. I didn't hear that part. I don't know if it's FBI, Interpol, um, CIA, who, marshals, whoever, feds, whoever. I don't know. I didn't hear that part, but they were placed under the witness protection program in some shape, form, or fashion. But I heard they played huge victim. So they played huge victim, it sounds like, to manipulate their way into the witness protection program. But I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. So you plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates for you. And I, re I remember, like, I've been doing this channel like a year and a half. I remember last year I was pulling somebody in that was placed under the witness protection program. Um, you can go back and check the readings. I think it's been about a year um, ish. Um, I remember that, but it's been a minute. It's been a hot minute. It's been about a year, but it was somebody that was placed under the witness protection program. Um, maybe it's the same person. Maybe it was a different one. I'm not sure. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, but I heard they played huge victim basically to be placed under the witness protection program. So they, they played this huge victim mentality to even be placed under the witness protection program, but I heard it's about to, um, backfire on them in a huge way. So you plug that in, how that resonates, if that resonates for you. Huge manipulation of sex magic there too. The one, one particular person that placed this person under witness protection program is really realizing this now, as is others. Oh my God. Whoa. Okay. Okay. So it's getting juicier. So whoever this is that um, was placed under the witness protection program, now I didn't hear a time frame when this person was. It might be the same one I was pulling in last year or a different person. But anyways, um, I heard... The main person that placed them under the witness protection program, they realized now this person used heavy sex magic to basically, and victim mentality, basically to place themselves under witness protection program. So they used heavy victim mentality, narcissistic energy, oh, poor me, woe is me energy, 
and they use heavy sex magic. So I think they um, sex magic. So they were placing doing sex spells on this main person that helped place them under the witness protection program or someone connected to the main person that helped place them under the witness protection program. But I heard the main person that placed them under the witness protection program is having a huge wake up call realizing they did perform this heavy sex magic and victim mentality techniques now to have them placed under the witness protection program as is others. So people were waking up to the behaviors of this person in the past that got them where they were, but they realized it was shiesty shy techniques, basically. Um, if that makes sense, that's what I'm feeling. Maybe you're, the, maybe one of you guys that I'm pulling in, if this resonates for you, maybe you're the one that placed this person under witness protection program, um, possibly, because there's a reason um, I'm getting the messages. So I think maybe, maybe you are the person I'm pulling in that placed this person under witness protection program, but you're looking hindsight is 2020 energy now and realizing they play sex magic on you. Or if this resonates with you, I think they might've slept with you, seduced you, slept with you, attempted to seduce you, either attempted to seduce you, seduced you, i.e. slept with you, or attempted to seduce somebody connected to you or did seduce somebody connected to you. That's what I'm feeling. That's what I'm feeling. Um, because you, I mean, and whoever you are, you know, you, you know about dark side and light side, you know about spirituality, you know about, um, occultist type stuff, basically, um, not cultist, not C-U-L-T, occultist. Now, occultist can be light side or dark side. Um, whoever this is that did sex magic, that is dark side energy spiritual spiritual messages and connecting with spirit that is light side just to clarify and let everybody know um but whoever this is with definite dark side definite um definite so um but you're having a huge wake up call and you're realizing it now so hindsight 2020 energy but i heard it's about to backfire on that person so i'd um I don't know how it's going to backfire. Maybe we'll hear more messages in here. I can't make it real, real long, you guys. I have big plans today. Just say it. I'm so excited. Spirit messages. Okay. Spirit messages you have reflected. Holy crap. This is looking great. Spirit messages you have. Oh, my God. Hold on. Okay, I got three out and they came out really, really quick. So we're going to take them. Compassion, blessings, and strength. For some, you can be dealing with the Leo because this is Leo energy in this deck. If you are, they can have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, mid, or Jupiter. If you're not, you could just be having lots of strength in this situation. Compassion, blessings, and strength. Sorry, my cards are so wore out, you guys. I haven't been able to find another deck like this since this is one of the original ones I bought a year and a half ago when I started the channel, but I haven't been able to find another one of these decks since. So I like to hold on to this one because it's very original. I haven't seen any other reader with this deck, and I love this deck. Um, so I'm trying to hold on to it, but it is it's very, very wore out. So just bear with me. Um, Maybe in six months, it'll have huge rips. I don't know, but I'm wearing these things out to the wheels fall off because I can't find another deck like this. Compassion, blessings, and strength. This person that was manipulated in a huge way to place this person under witness protection program Realizes now who really should have been placed under the witness protection program. They are about to help bless this person in many, many ways. This person has a family. Oh my God. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. This is, um, this is strong. So if this resonates with you, the, I do feel like I'm pulling in the person that did place this person under witness, the sex magic person. The sex magic victim mentality as type person. Uh, I feel you, I'm pulling you in. The person that placed this person or, or, help, or help place them 
or no witness protection program, whoever you are. I feel your governmental entity agency energy or law enforcement, or maybe your retired law enforcement or um, Fed energy or CIA or Marshall or something like that. However you resonate, if whoever you are, that's what I'm feeling. Um, but how, however you resonate, um, I didn't hear specifically who you are, but however you resonate, I heard you're realizing now who should have really been under the witness protection program and who should not have been. And the person that you helped place under there, if this specific story resonates with you, you realize should not have been placed under there. Um, and it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. But the person that should have been placed under the witness protection program that wasn't placed under it, they have a family. So I heard you're about to help this person out, the person that should have been placed under witness protection program that wasn't, that has a family out in a huge way, if this resonates with you. So I, you're, oh, sorry. You're about to have lots of compassion, love. Now, I don't think this is romantic. Ooh, baby, I'm going to jump your bones. Like that, like sex magic. Ooh, baby, I'm going to jump your bones. No, nay, nay. This is like actual heart chakra compassion. Like, compassion for this person that should have been placed under the witness protection program and they should have been but they wasn't and they have a family um like heart chakra caring compassion is what i'm trying to say like love of the universe compassion not like oh baby sex magic i'm going to jump your bones all night long just say i just want to clarify um love of the universe having caring and heart and compassion and love for people in the world is not fifty dollars to make you holler energy and I mean, I'm not trying to be like crass or want, I mean, I'm, I'm not, but I know people say I'm really too blunt on here, but I don't know how to explain it. I mean, it's not, it's not like that. It is completely opposite, you know? So, um, you're about to have, um, lots of compassion for this person, which is, um, which is beautiful. That's beautiful energy it really is. It is. Sorry, y'all. My hair is so gray, gray. Blessings. You're about to bestow lots of blessings on this family. Some indirectly through other people. Some you will show your face soon. And make it known. Okay. Okay. Um, hidden. See, I want to call you secret agent man or woman. That's what I want to secret agent man, secret agent woman. Just, I mean, that's what I feel like calling you. I'm serious. Um, you have to have the authority and jurisdiction to place somebody under witness protection program. So you have to be, you have to be a position of high authority energy in the governmental sector in some shape, form or fashion. And I'm, I'm serious. Um, I'm feeling fed level. I am. I feel a fed level, but I don't know. I don't know. I didn't hear that. So, um, how that resonates, but I heard your body basically about to bestow lots of blessings on this family that should have been placed under witness protection program, but they were not because you were, you were manipulated by somebody else that was placed under a um, witness protection program, but they shouldn't have been basically, but you have identified this or you're about to identify this victim mentality sex magic crap and you are about to identify the difference basically and it sounds like you're about to make it right which is which is very nightly just saying masculine and feminine i mean that's the way it should be balance restored back in the universe so absolutely freaking lootly man um you go with your bad sale so i heard you're about to indirectly did bestow blessings upon this family that should have been in the witness protection program but they wasn't um indirectly through other people so other you're going to reach out i think to other people and have them i think you're i heard you're going to indirectly do it through other people so i think you're going to reach out to other people and explain the situation and maybe and once you explain the situation they better understand it and so they would be more willing to help the family that's what i think that's what i think now, it could be in the form of physical items. Um, it could be information that these people, that this is not you doing it. It's you reaching out to other people and other people are going to bestow these blessings upon this family um, is what I'm feeling from the message. So these other people, the people you're about to reach out to, that's going to help the family, 
want to explain the situation, they, I think, whatever they're going, blessings they're going to bestow upon this family, which is i.e. indirect energy from you, I think it could be physical items, it could be monetary, it could be information to get physical items or monetary, it could be um, something else, something else. That's what I think. But you plug it in how it resonates. So blessings, indirect, a lot of indirect from other people, not physically from you. But then I heard on the end of that, Kel, in that message, that you will eventually reach out yourself to this family um, and make your presence known. So you will communicate with the head of household or head of households um, and possibly the children, possibly. But you will make your presence known eventually it doesn't sound like you're going to do it at first it sounds like you're going to reach out to these other people indirectly first explain the situation and they're going to reach out to the family first um and then you are and then you are and make your presence known so however that resonates so lots of blessing energy if this resonates for you now i want to tell you guys either you're the person i do feel i'm drawing in the person that's about to do this for this family absolutely that's the energy of the person this is the energy of the person I feel is about to do this for this family. But energies can be reversed. So for other of you guys that don't resonate with that, you could be the other end, other spectrum of that. Energies can be reversed. So you could be the family that's about to get these blessings bestowed upon you. That um, you should have been in the witness protection program and you wasn't because some manipulative, greedy ass person placing sex magic on a freaking... Um, position a high authority um, person. They knew exactly what they were doing. Whoever that placed this um, sex magic on this person, they obviously know how to use their sexual wilds. It could be masculine or feminine. I'm serious, but they know how to use their body to get what they want. Um, and they know how to play victim to get what they want too. Um, but you could be the family, you could be, like I said, roles could be reversed, you could be the family that's about to get reached out to indirectly and then directly by the other person the secret asian man secret asian woman just saying string you have serious regret because you know you made a huge mistake but it doesn't mean it can't be amended now and you know this and you're about to make it happen Oh my God, this is beautiful. So you plug it in how it resonates. So I heard you know you made a huge mistake in the past. Um, person that helped place this person under a witness protection program, basically. Um, but it doesn't mean that you can't help amend it now. And I heard you're about to. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. For some, it is this person. And for some, it is a person that gave reward energy out to someone they shouldn't have. Okay, heard for some it is this person, so for some it is this, I think, secret agent man or woman energy, to be honest with you, or governmental entity agency S type energy or law enforcement possibly energy that did, um, that placed this, helped place this person under witness protection program in all seriousness, I do. Um, but there's another person that gave reward uh, energy, reward money uh, energy out basically they get reward money out to a person that they shouldn't have given it out to basically that person did not they shouldn't have received the reward money but they did and they're about to help amend that as well and i strongly feel that person might be a taurus or they have taurus in their chart because i picked that i've been picking that up in taurus's reading possibly but you plug that in how that resonates but this is strength to help amend the wrong of the past they know they made an error, um, and it's a, it sounds like a big error, but it doesn't mean that they can't amend it now, because it sounds like whoever this is, they, they're knowing the truth. They either have just learned the truth or about to learn the truth, and they're about to have lots of strength to amend it, basically. So strength, whether it's the person that helped place this person in witness protection program, or the person that gave reward money out to somebody that shouldn't have been given it out to, basically. How would that resonate? Or you are the family that should have been placed under witness protection program and you wasn't. However that resonates for you in your life, I feel it could go any of those ways.
feel like a weird cheerleader. Yeah, just saying. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't hear anything else. All right, you guys, this is actually a pretty beautiful reading. I'm um, secret agent man or secret agent woman. Um, kudos to you for about to making amending things in a correct manner. I just want to say that. Um, my hat's off to you, sir or ma'am. Um, because that's the way it should be. Because that um, creates faith in people. Creates faith in, in humanity and faith in doing the right thing. And faith that um, things will, you know, that you can, um, knowing that you do put good into the universe, good will come back to you energy. Um, that's, that's the way I look at it. All right. I love you guys. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.